Interventional nephrology is a new field that has uh, come on uh, track over the last, uh, I guess, 10 to 15 years. Um, it was mostly created by uh, Gerald Bethard, who is a nephrologist uh, currently in Austin, Texas. Uh, he would be listed as our grandfather of uh, interventional nephrology. Uh, because it's a new field, uh, there's not uh, a lot that has uh, developed in it at present. However, the specific aspects of uh, interventional nephrology, for the, obviously for the nephrologist, means that this individual performs uh, several tasks. One, he places cuff tunnel catheters uh, in his dialysis patients. He also takes care of the vascular access, whether that be a vascular, whether that be a graft or whether that is a fistula. He takes care of those accesses to make sure that they are appropriately running, that they provide good clearance and good function for his dialysis patient. Uh, the other aspects of interventional nephrology uh, include uh, renal ultrasound as well. It would include many other uh, aspects too, one of which would be renal biopsy. Renal biopsy, the nephrologist has pretty much gotten out of uh, these days, at least Carolina Nephrology has, unfortunately. But uh, it's just not done much, and because of that, uh, the comfort level has to be there. But interventional nephrology has certainly improved our practice and has uh, enabled us to take care of our dialysis patient far better. It is a field that is certainly increasing in number of interventional nephrologists and they too are experiencing an increase in uh, working with their dialysis patients and uh, giving them uh, excellent care. I think this has improved our relationship with the vascular surgeons uh, also, as well as interventional radiologists, our colleagues uh, in, in taking care of these uh, special folks.